What is it? That sure doesn't look like it's unlinear, does look it? Look how fast she got. She's a lot faster, isn't she? But we're getting our exercise in. Yeah. Kicking up some uh, I don't think this is what I want to do. Let me double check something here. Some really, uh, bright, uh, no. Can't see anything. Oh, that is good enough. All right, here we go. That looks like it's on. She likes both. Yeah, she's doing good, isn't she? Will she follow you? Yes. Turn around and start walking that way. Go. She'll chase him. Another way. What do you mean? Down the hill. Oh, down the hill. She's following me now. You need to come get your bird. Let's go. She likes your shoes. Look, look how fast she got. She's not running. She's like, which one? She's camera shy. I'm going to... She's getting a little bigger, huh? A little healthier. Yeah, back up again and see if she comes to you. Come to Papa. She's about to attack me. You are the chicken whisperer. My back screen just went off. I gotta adjust that too. I got the new Hero 7. And uh, when the back screen goes off I can't see what I'm pointing this thing at I think I adjusted it a little better let's see how this works out this is where the little door is gonna go for the birdie 19 inches from there to there and this is gonna be the top so it needs to go about right no it can't go that high because I have to there's my board up there, and then there's a board on the bottom. I don't know if you, you can't even see that. My hand is my hand is my hand. Let's see if this even works. I mean, I know the drill works. That one goes because I gotta cut through it. I just realized something though. These are not T25s, so it's not a standard bit that I use, so not that that's important. What's she doing? I just realized they didn't. I need, uh, I need more screws. One, two, three. I need six on top, six on the bottom, five on top. Yes, it's off. That was perfect. I just looked at it from inside. You had it perfectly on the I don't know how she's going to step up though and get in that. Huh? How's she gonna step up and get Well, that won't. The door's gonna flip down if my hinges work like I want them to. Okay. I'm using cabinet what hinges. Oh, there she is. Oh, she's she... something really loud behind me. Oh. Ah, oh, there's a bazillion ants all over my. That's not good. Oh my goodness, look at oh. all the fire ants. Daddy, I see them. That's not good for our chicken. Hand me that spray. Spray? Go back out. Oh. Get it right there. Oh my goodness. Hurry, they're all right there. It's that white bottle. Oh. You need spray for you? No, I want you to hand me the spray. Sorry. Right. We're just 
chickens must be able to like fully fly. Yeah, most chickens can fly. Oh, that's so cool. She might become worse. I got the fire ant sprayed. Now I got to keep the bird out of here for a while and hope that these little hinges work. I think they will. These boards are oak. So we'll set those in right there. We'll put the hinge right here. See my plan in a minute why I had to do this first before I put my board. Oh, get ready. Alright, I'll be there in a while. Try not to stand in the ants if you wonder why I'm standing so far away from the actual work site, if you will. They're a little cockeyed, but it's not for sale. So. I've never seen that chicken from like both. I don't see how it's going to work. It's going to lay down and like the chicken's going to climb up the, the ramp. Yeah, I'm hoping the ramp's tall enough. It's not. Yeah, it's going to be like a ramp. It's going to be cool. That's sweet. A um, couple screws short. Oh, man. Never mind, it pulled it. I thought I needed you to go around inside. That board split. I'm trying to catch more. That's why I'm going up with the screws. Where's my 19er? Is that it? Yes. Now. Uh, put two this screws. Work? Huh? How this, work? this should work. I'm gonna watch. Son, I need you to do me a favor. Sorry, okay, no, I don't. Okay. That one held. Something wrong with the wood. Oh, I know what you want. I want the screws on the back board, but. We're not there yet. I gotta do one more change. Okay. Hey, Daddy, do you think we're gonna leave here? I'm gonna get a small car. No, we're not gonna get a car today. Maybe these screws will reach a little better. Oh my. Fire ants rather funny. <laughs> Have a funny bite. It hurts. Okay, now. Now? I think your left foot is in fire ants. And you are. 
Huh? So now here's the big test. Do I even have this camera on? Who knows? It opened. Yay! For a Woo! quick fix, that's okay for right now. That's but good. it's not long enough, and I don't know if our hinges are gonna stay. And it, those are not All the way. Foot. And the screws will poke in her foot. But I can put another board right here. Oh yeah, you can. And on top, so they don't. Oh yeah. It works. Good. It works. It just needs. We need to put a little clasp. You're in the firing zone. Oh, fire we'll put another little clasp up top. And we can ex we can put another board out here that goes up to about right there with a little handle and you can open it and the whole thing will go down and she can walk all the way to the ground. You know what I mean? If you put a board here and go all the way up, you get what I'm saying? Mm -mm. You're not feel me, you don't feel me? No. I was confused. Because it does drop pretty far. She could probably that she could probably get up there, I bet. She might can. If we can just fix those. Yeah, I'll get rid of those. Yeah, she's a pretty good little bird, huh? Mm -hmm. We need to like, clean her up. She's actually cleaned up a lot. She doesn't have the bloody feathers so bad. I thought it was actually just a neat color, but it was blood. Her beak is healing up. What happened to her beak? She escaped a Tyson truck. You know that. And she uh, Come get them up. doesn't have flight skills yet all the way. Well, I kind of got a plan there. Yellow jackets coming out. They always come out in the fall. And, uh, sting me. They don't like me. Come on. Screws, these are actually sheetrock screws. <laughs> But, that one's gonna go right there. Underneath the other two screws. So that hides the screws. She's think I'll be right there. Now all we need is to make it longer. Don't you think? It's not the prettiest thing in the world, but it works. Uh, hang on, you got stuck on the fence. And you just put a little stop on the end that'll raise it up a little higher, but she can easily walk up that. I'm like treating her like she's an infant. So now <laughs> we gotta baby chick her cage. Get it so the baby proof. Actually, it's chick proof. Yeah, chick proof her cage so she doesn't uh, hurt a little self. And now the final touch, other than a lock on it, which I will figure out in a minute is a handle and I've got this lovely brass funny colored other one that I'm going to use right here because you'll need it you'll need it when you uh when I get a lock on it, get it tighter, it won't come down so easy.
the hinges are actually loaded too, so it actually tries to hold itself shut. Sure, it'd work better if I had about 10 more on there, but. Never ask y'all for anything, but I'm one screw short. Can somebody send me a screw? What's wrong, son? I'm just kidding. Where is she? Come on. Hi. Call her down here. Hi, Come on. Come on what is she doing? Ignoring us? No. Come on. No, no, no. She's in the zone up there. Okay. okay, chicken test. Is she on the ground? Yes. Come on, girl. Who's the smartest chicken in the world? Why did the chicken cross the plank? Come on. Come on, girl. Come on. She's still going, wow, this is pretty cool. Yeah, come in here. She'll come down for you. Put your hand down like you, yeah. Now I made cut. this, that whole thing so you wouldn't pull a muscle. Aww, she took the shortcut. <laughs> well, that's good enough. Now go back in the building and see if she comes back to you. Okay. She probably won't. No, probably not. She might act like you got something in your hand. Hold on, you left the... Hey! Yeah, act like you have something in your hand. Call her. Where is she? She's over Kitty. here. I'm at, I'm at. Kitty. <laughs> Stick your hand out a little more. Come here. Oh gosh. She's coming back. Turn your hand over. Come on. Come on, tiny. Come on. Come on. Alright, she don't want to play. Yeah, she doesn't have any interest. She probably needs some water to wash down all those uh grasshopper guts. All right, now that y'all have had enough of the chicken, that's it. This is her little rant. Okay. Yeah, sit up there, sister. Okay. Sure. Try to go in there. Keep her there. Keep her there. No, no, no. No. Yeah, she's okay. She don't want to be away from your foot. I decided to uh, get a small bristled brush and then SB squared actually a soft bristle which is the same thing in SB squared and come back over it again just to clean up the metal part to be able to differentiate between where the metal stops and the wood starts and I think it's gonna work out fine I did a little test area on this side this is the side that's gonna be not so much display but I got to thinking I may just put a little drinky dink gun rack on the wall <laughs> and just sit it up there. I don't really want it mounted to anything. So, if you want to watch, hang around and we'll see how it works out. I just wish I knew. I guess I could take out my good pictures and see. I think you can see that. Maybe not so much a reflection of me, but the actual metal goes on down right here. The plate would come on to right here. I can kind of see it now. Yeah, I think right there. So I'm going to go ahead and do this. And I might touch around here a little bit. And then I'm going to flip it over and work on the other side. See, I'm, I'm wondering if I've got a different model than this one though. I don't know for sure. So if you know how to determine the model of these, there's a couple of variations. And I believe this is one of them, <laughs> if that helps. I'm gonna try to get where I can work and you can still see, which is the goal of you tubulation, right? So I'm going to put on this mask because it gets a little dusty. 
and then I got my little Dremel on a stick right here. Yeah, I put my glasses on my face like so. Then we'll start working slowly. Just get ready for a little buzz. It's actually a pretty pleasant sound. <laughs> better it's cleaning it up it's just getting all the big all the loose flakes off and then I put some of the metal preservative back on it and it may just turn it black all over again I don't know be better if I put it on time-lapse that way it's fast you don't have to hear it let's do that well these last about 30 seconds and I only had two so let's uh, let's do a little uh, chipping you want to see if we can clean up a little more it's coming out nice I like it I need to spray it it is a uh, humid out here right now and I don't want to start resting again so let me get my tools of the trade my dad is very optimistic when it comes to stuff like this. He said, oh yeah, you can clean up a lot more off that thing. I'm just still nervous about taking a lot more off. There were some spots I was gonna work on for certain, for certain though, maybe right in here. Yes, like that. 
Oh, he is still coming up. I was a little concerned about doing it with it dry too, because when it's wet, I think it separates from the wood easier, but I don't know if that's true or not. Now that's the piece that got down into some wood earlier on another video, but it's okay. Are my fingernails clean? A lot of rocks in here. Anybody look up how long it takes for a piece of wood to petrify? And I do believe the preservation solution stuff helped a lot. A whole lot. Oh, I know what we're gonna work on. We're gonna clean up around the uh, hammer a little more. Just right in here. My hands, the uh, actual oils from your hands will make things start rusting again too. But you probably knew that. See, all that's rock. Now here's the kicker, look at this. That. Is where a metal band was. And that is wood. That's actually kind of soft right there. And that's not. mess with the other side where the band is. I think that would be a serious error. Coming out through here though. As you can see the difference in the barrel and the wood. There's the wood. There's the barrel.
See, that's a big hunk right there. You see that? But you gotta ask yourself, do you feel lucky? Good enough on that. I gotta get a magnet because I think that was made of ferrous material. Although the originals, that sure looks brass, doesn't it? Hang on, let me really get a magnet. I got a little magnet and I dried it off. Oh yeah, there ain't no way that's brass. I joke about to snatch that out of my hand. This for sure. Nice. Oh my goodness. That's a good ma magnet. Put it right here. Okay, I was right. It is not brass. I forgot where I need to go next. I don't even know if I need to be doing any more. I wish I had another little brass bristled brush but I don't That's about as rounded off as it's going to get. Make it look like a hammer again. Do y'all remember what it looked like when I pulled it out of the water? Let me show you a photograph. Just for memories. Hang on, I got it right here somewhere. I'm looking at my Denwa. It's phone in Japanese. I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm backwards looking, backwards looking, not too easy, not too easy. Remember how bad it was? That one may be a little clearer. It was full of rocks. So we've come a long way, huh? But do I need to go any further? That's the underwater. <laughs> There's Zach. Zach's nimble, Zach's quick. You know, I heard that Zach jumped over a candlestick. Look at that. So the question is, do we want to go any further? I know you're asking yourself, well, why did he start this video if he's not going to go any further? I don't know, I just... I want y'all to see my progress or my errors. Oh, this is going off. My progress or my errors. It's 
See, I believe there was a screw right here. I don't know about right here. I don't think that's a screw. Oh yeah, down the wood. Any of that hit you on the face yet? It's hitting me. I don't have on glasses. Are y'all cringing every time I hit this thing with a hammer? I don't know what this is. It's just for metal. There we go. It is coming off. Oh yeah, my ring's below my hand, that's right. I thought I was going too far. It's like getting a haircut. Except this doesn't grow back. I would like that chunk gone, but I don't want this last piece of saddle ring messed up. But I think I might be able to get that one out without messing up the saddle ring. This is where you need to cringe. I did it, I did it, I did it. All right. That's enough. Right there. That is a pen where the, uh, the breech opened up and rotated on that. For those of you just joining us, I do not worship the artifact. Let me make that clear. I just think it's absolutely incredible find something like this, nor am I a fan of human human trafficking, which is what slavery really was. So, I would have had to have moved had I been alive in that time if I was from Alabama because I couldn't. 
hung around for that. This is a Union soldier's weapon. Carbine. We know that. Zach researched it down. Zach Bird's Adventure Hour is what I'm talking about. You can check out his channel. He researched it down to actually who crossed down to the day when they crossed the river we were in. There's a website. I'll tell you. I don't remember the name of it. So never mind on that. What do you think? Leave it alone. I wonder what that is. There's a rock that probably needs to stay. Wouldn't you think so? I don't know about all this. Oh, it is coming off. It would be nice to see the differentiation between this lever and the actual trigger guard. But I cannot establish a fulcrum without resting on this. This makes me nervous. I can't see either. I'm thinking. to try to run up through there probably because that could actually get too thin couldn't it that is a rock right there that's going to stay for the rest of its life these little rocks can go
Yeah, let's stop for now. So there's the wood. It's dried out nicely, hasn't it? Maybe you ain't got a good look at the end. Look at it. That is dirt in there. Hmm. Let's see, I got all the big ones off right there. That yellow is the junk that came off, the sludge that came off when I put it in the preservation solution. I think that's it. Can I get a look at it real quick? Oops, I got you. Got your arm hung, sorry about that. That's looking pretty good, isn't it? I'm probably done. I just want to keep showing it to you over and over and over and over. Not because I'm proud, but because I'm proud of it. It is neat, isn't it? And y'all were there with me to see it. It made it all the more better. So I guess I'm done for right now. And thanks for watching my videos.